How can new users access my Moodle? There are two steps to adding users to your Moodle site so they can teach or learn in your courses. To have access to the site, they must first have accounts. Moodle calls this authentication. And they must then have access to the appropriate courses. Moodle calls this enrolment. It's important to know the difference and to understand that you need both of these for users to gain access to your site and courses. There are several types of authentication and several types of enrolment. As an administrator, you can click Site Administration and see a number of tabs. From the Plugins tab, you'll see Authentication and Enrolment. Click Manage Authentication. Here is a list of the authentication plugins, that is, different methods to allow users to access your site. The ones greyed out are not active or enabled. Click the eye to enable the ones you need. Watch the videos on adding users to your site for more detailed information. From Enrollment, click Manage Enroll Plugins. Here is a list of course enrollment plugins, that is, different methods to allow users into your courses. Enabling any plugins here will mean they'll be available for use in courses in your site. For example, if you want to use PayPal for paying courses, click the I to enable it. Watch the videos on enrolling users into courses for more detailed information. To summarise, there are two steps to adding users to your Moodle site so they can teach and learn, authentication and enrolment.